We're very excited to announce the new RAW model in Denoise AI version 3.3. And the major benefit to using this model with your RAW files is that we're able to use all of that sensor data that's in your RAW file to provide the cleanest possible noise reduction while preserving all those important edge details. You can see here I have the original RAW file on the left and then the processed version using the new RAW model on the right. Now, we can also use the comparison view to compare it against our other existing models. And so you can see we have the new RAW model in the top left quadrant and clear, low light, and severe noise models in the remaining three quadrants. And in case you can't see the improvements that the RAW model provides here, let me show you a different view. We applied a curves adjustment and desaturated the colors to make it easier to see the improvements that the RAW model provides. Notice how much cleaner the results are in the RAW model and how there is absolutely no modeling, especially when compared to the other models. We've also improved the way we handle color and tone reproduction when saving DNG files. Here in Lightroom Classic, you can see the original RAW file on the left and the DNG output on the right. And I wanted to show this to you to illustrate just how accurate the color and tone is between that RAW file and our DNG file using the new RAW model from Denoise AI. We're very excited about the new RAW model in Denoise AI. And if you wanna try it for yourself, head over to topazlabs.com to download a free trial today.